combo of femasat and hydrochlorothiazide benefits hypertensive patients. Hypertension is a major independent risk factor for coronary artery disease, stroke, and renal failure. Reducing the blood pressure below the target goal is important to prevent cardiovascular and cerebrovascular events. Femasartan is one of the new antihypertensive drugs that lower the blood pressure by blocking the angiotensin II type 1 receptor. Availability of various antihypertensive drugs achieving target blood pressure is difficult in the majority of the patients with hypertension. Most of them require a combination of two or more drugs to achieve their target blood pressure, as blood pressure reduction is difficult with monotherapy. The most common drug used in the combination with angiotensin receptor blockers is hydrochlorothiazide. The main objective of the study was to compare the blood pressure lowering efficacy of femasartan alone with that of femasartan hydrochlorothiazide treatment in the patients with blood pressure. Patients were included if they had mean value of the two sitting diastolic blood pressure reading were less than 110 mm on screening visit who were on antihypertensive medication and mean values of the two sitting diastolic blood pressure reading was greater than or equal to 90 mm of mercury and less than 120 mm on screening visit who were on antihypertensive naive Patients were excluded if they had mean sitting systolic blood pressure greater than or equal to 200 mm of mercury. At the screening visit, difference of sitting systolic blood pressure greater than or equal to 20 mm of mercury or sitting diastolic blood pressure greater than or equal to 10 mm of mercury between arms. Secondary hypertension, renal impairment, active hepatitis B or C positive status for human immune virus electrolyte imbalance, insulin dependent or uncontrolled diabetes mellitus, retinal hemorrhage, and drug or alcohol dependency. A total of 654 patients were selected for the study. Patients of age 18 years and above were enrolled in the study. The study was conducted at 18 institutions as a multicenter, randomized, active controlled, double blind, parallel group, and dose titration trial. The study design was approved by the Career Food Drug Administration and Institutional Review Board of each site. A total of 654 patients were selected for the study. Among them, 263 were matched to eligible for the randomization criteria. Among the 263 patients, 175 were assigned to take four weeks of femasartan hydrochlorothiazide treatment, and 88 were assigned to take femasartan treatment. At each visit, after five minutes of the rest in a sitting position, sitting systolic blood pressure, sitting diastolic blood pressure, and pulse rate were measured twice with a one-minute interval between measurements in the same arm. The average two sitting blood pressure measurements were used, and all adverse events were evaluated and recorded at each visit. The change from the baseline in sitting diastolic blood pressure and sitting systolic blood pressure of the two groups at the end of four and eight weeks of the treatment were compared by two sample T test. Demographic characteristics were compared by using the Wilcoxon rank sum test or t-test for continuous variables and the chi-square test or fisher's exact test for categorical variables from the baseline to week 8 the response rate of the femasartan hydrochlorothiazide treatment was higher than that of the femasartan treatment it showed the greater reduction of sitting diastolic blood pressure compared to the femasartan group from the baseline to week 8 the response rate of the femasartan hydrochlorothiazide treatment 
was higher than that of the femur artan treatment. It showed the greater reduction of sitting systolic blood pressure compared to the femur artan group. The results of the current study proved that the combination treatment with femur artan and hydrochlorothiazide was effective in the patients with hypertension. The combination femur artan and hydrochlorothiazide treatment was safety and tolerable.